lovely leopard. Kiruta is one of the most beautiful leopards, one of the main character leopards into the area for us as warrior people who really likes to follow the leopard. From the beginning, the Kurula, she was the leopard that hangs around quite a lot into the area. And it's one of the leopards that we really after her every day into the area. Tribes and we have enjoyed a lot of sight of the youngster. Being two years old, having it to the point which I'm not sure exactly where the youngster could be. They might be around into the area that we are um, in our neighbor farms, which we're not sure exactly. The leopard cover very good uh, area as a territorial boundaries. So the cubs are living within the territorial area of the mother, a lot more safe on that spot. If they cross over the boundary of the mother, then it will be a problem. And I believe this, this female should have done well. She raised two cubs. It's the first litter. And the cubs now, they might be big enough to protect themselves from hyena, leopard, I mean, getting up to it as quick as they can. confirms it's beautiful leopard as I mentioned this and this is one of the animals it's very difficult to, to locate them into the area, more especially uh, the area is very, very thick at the stage. And how this we get to see the leopard? Alex was driving early in the morning from um, the base into the garage. On his way, he bumped into the leopard and we let the other guys know there's a leopard along the road moving from quarantine into heading into south. So it could be uh, asked to get to spot the leopard area and when it's the matter of the vehicle that was still around on that area. So we should have to have more time on it. She's, she's lovely leopard, she's a lot more relaxed on vehicles. I've seen her a lot of time coming close to the vehicle of about less than a meter. And she's, she's very good with vehicles. She's one of the leopards that grows into the, grow up into the area. And now because it's having cubs and between two males that are a little bit having competition between Mafufu Nyan and the Jordan's male, it looks like the leopard have moved and the cubs into the west. And now she looks like she's coming back. She'd been sighted, I mean, about a week ago at in quarantine 
and today she's right here. She might be back with the cubs because the air is it's too thick we weren't able to get to see them. It's better in winter because if you find the tracks you can able to follow wherever you want to go. But now it's difficult because of the grass situation is very very long and tall. Tracks is difficult to, to follow up with the leopard. Okay, copy. Uh, I will try once more again. Copy. I'll try that. I tried to send Alex to take off those grass in front of the leopard face. It will be good, Alex. Uh, she's a very good leopard. A leopard is a species that um, get active at night and it hunts at night. During the day, most of the time like this because it's too hot. So I like cracking now. And you can feel it is very, very hot from here. We can feel it from where we are because there's no cover. And that's a lot of energy from all the cats that are um, around in our areas here in service and Juma. So most of this time for them, they tend to lie down and relax. And they'll get active late afternoon between 5 to 6. From 5 o'clock, 6 o'clock, somewhere there in between, they get uh, to be active moving around and try to hunt at night if they can able to kill they will be lucky if not they will be active until early in the morning six o'clock seven o'clock they will be active around into the area look at the track of this leopard look like she's coming on vietnam driveway due west of our camp Sandy Patch area. If cops, they might be around on that area further more into the west. And my father is the father of um, two cops that uh, the ruler belongs to. Uh, and he is actually a dominant male furthermore into the western part of our farm up to southwest we have seen him a week ago a big male which is a lot more relaxed too she, he is the one that mate with uh, Kurula this leopard lying down here is Kurula so all the, name, the leopard that are living in the area especially the, le the relaxed leopard, they all have names. Uh, we've given them names and they all have identification with the spots just above the whiskies. It having spots that you can know. The other side might have three, the other side have three, the other one, it depends with the leopard. Some of them they have four, and all have two or three, two. Then you can identify the leopard easy which one is this. But Kurula and Mafufunyan and the other males, other leopards that are into the area, 
even from that tracks we can tell you which one is this because they've been into the area for a while and we have studied much about them from tracks and also up to the behavior of the leopard. Some of the leopards will never ever track them without knowing uh, their behavior into the area. Tracking gorilla is like tracking something else that I can know it's not, will never, it will never ever come back or fight. Soon get to see you, you'll know that the human being into the area.